In this video, Timmy's going to show you how to add contacts in Gmail. So, if you're using Gmail for your emails, you may have noticed when you look around, there's not really anywhere that you can actually click to add a contact into Gmail, so that when you're emailing people, you have them saved as a contact. And the reason for that is actually because Gmail uses contacts from Google Contacts. So you'll actually need to go into Google Contacts and separately add the contact in there. And then when you come back to Gmail, the contact will actually be there ready for you to compose an email to that contact. So in this video, Timmy's going to show you all about how to do that. So when you're in Gmail and you're logged into your Google account here, the easiest way that you can get to your contacts is to actually come down in the right hand menu here and click on contacts here. And now it will open up a list of your contacts. And if this option isn't available here, so you don't have this bar along the side here, that probably just means it's being slid away like that. So it doesn't show up. So you just need to click on this arrow down here and then click on contacts, but you'll probably have that bar and you'll have that icon. So you probably won't have to do that. And now you'll be able to see all your contacts that are in Google Contacts. So you can see them all here, but you still actually can't create one, which is a bit annoying. So to create a contact, you'll actually need to click on this button here to open Google Contacts in a new tab. So click on that. And now it will open up Google Contacts in a new tab in your web browser. And now you'll have this Create Contact button. So you can just click on Create Contact and then click create a contact. And now you'll be at a page where you can fill out all the information. So you can put in heaps of different things if you want, but to make things simple, really all you're going to need is their first name, maybe last name and email. So Timmy's just going to fill in that right now. So Timmy's filled out all the really important information. You could go into more detail if you want, you could add company and job title and if you click show more, there's heaps of different things you can enter, but really all that matters is putting in their name and email address. And then once you're happy with everything you've put in, you'll just need to click on save here. And now it will save that contact to your Google contacts. And it says new contact created down here. So now you can go back to Gmail and you will have to refresh Gmail for it to show up. So just click on refresh in your browser, wherever that is and wait for it to reload. And now if you click on compose here and you start typing, you'll see that the new contact you added is now in here in your contacts. So you can send emails to them really easily. So that's really cool. And that's how you can just manually create a contact in Gmail, but you can also actually really easily create a contact when someone sent you an email. So, for example, Timmy has this email here from Bob. And if you want to add Bob as a contact really easily, all you'd have to do is open the email. So it's open like this and then hover over their picture. So it might not be a picture. It might just be this icon like this, but hover your mouse over whatever would be their picture. And now you'll see over here, there's this add to contacts button. So you can just click on that and it will take a few seconds, but now it has added Bob to contacts. So now if you go back to compose and start composing, if you type Bob, you'll see Bob is in here in your contacts. So that's really cool. And that's just another way that you can add contacts in Gmail. So that's really cool. And that's all there is to it. And hopefully you found this video helpful. And if you did, please click on the thumbs up button down below. And if you want to see more videos like this, click on the subscribe button down below and click on the little bell icon next to the subscribe button to be notified every time Timmy makes a new video. So that's really cool. And Timmy will see you in the next video.